what's up everybody wave podcast i'm zanzi we're back episode 15 i feel like that was too calm it has to track in. Hey, yes, uh. hey, what's up? Uh, we podcast in Zanzi. We back. King Hotel from Guni. Talk about that. Bomb dropped. Aha. Uh-huh. We're about to drop a bomb. Oh we'll shit. We'll talk about that yeah. in another episode. I might throw it in this when this episode drops. Yeah. I think the video might be done. Just it's a surprise. Good bomb. It's a surprise. Just know it's a bomb. The yeah. Bashabaga bomb. Uh, Brody, episode fifteen. Now. Major one, one five, five in Ghana. If we don't get into it, let's talk. Oh, yeah, 15. Yeah, we never spoke about this. Youngster CPT gave us a co sign. He actually shared our work. Retweeted. I knew oh, no, we'd get a chance to celebrate, give him proper recognition. Today's uh, a day. Bless we her. Talk with the love. Uh, okay. Uh, major targets. Uh-huh. Big artists, well known artists. I got Boiti. I got Major League DJs. Who you got on the. Uh, Underrated. Ah, I got MT and Benny P and shout out still the pre JC and we out here. Let's keep the ball rolling, man. Yeah, man. Um, okay. Boiti first. Right, right, right. I heard she did a Sosh Plata remix. Okay. Did didn't, I, I didn't even see or hear that. A lot of people have been doing that. Beast did it. Yeah, yeah, Beast uh, yeah. G- 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 it, was it, was a nice, it was a nice take on that Zulu Shandis. Okay. Boiti, I'm not impressed. Oh, you I don't know at this point if I just have beef with female rappers. But I, I feel the next thing you're gonna say, you're gonna say females should stick to what females are supposed to do. You know, uh, that's misogynistic. No, you wanna get me cancelled. <laughs> <Hey, laughs> yeah, no, but really, man, huh? I've heard Boiti do okay on some songs. Yeah, so, like Uta Tango uh, Very, very nice. few female rappers, like I said, that are in the limelight that impress me. A lot of female rappers uh, are good enough to impress me, but not all of them are in the limelight. Most are very underrated. Some of them can outrap a lot of niggas. But when it comes to Poeti, she's one of those that are in the limelight that aren't terrible. But that remix, she should have left it alone. Sosh Plata is... It was not necessary. It's, it's, like, it's like Mnige. It's like, okay, I can't compare it to the national anthem. But, like, <laughs> I can't, national anthem, I it. No, no. Sister Petit. Oh, no, yeah, that's, that's the national that song, anthem. That yeah. song should not be touched. Yeah, yeah, know. yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think SA would ever be happy with a remix of that. So, Kumuraguma Idols, they won. So, means Aquatele Lomunye, Azo Azo Kulalapa, Sister Petina, Azo Ulonuzo, Uzo Kabana, now Mukharib. Uzo Kabana now. And she had this fucking serious look on his face, but onto that. No, nah, bro, like, people people like to touch things that shouldn't be touched. So I feel like Sosh Plata is one of those songs. It's not just the Boiti thing. Like I but said, with Beast, you were with impressed. Pista, I, was, I wouldn't say impressed, but I was happy with the turnout. Right, with right. Boiti, it wasn't bad, but I wasn't pleased with it either. Shout like, out to the kids. She might as well have left it alone. Right, so, shout out to the kids, your though. thoughts on, on Boiti? I would yeah, out dope. Oh, she's, a, she's beautiful, man. I think I would, I would like to take Boiti her out sometime. Yeah? Boiti bad as fuck. Yeah, she, she bad as fuck. Song. Yeah, she, yeah. By, uh, from U, Yana. Yeah. Dedicated to her. Boiti. Do you think Boiti. that was a shot at Kess? There's one and Elizabeth Kamban. But I don't know. But anyway, I would do the same thing and I would like to take her out sometime. Boiti, uh, wait, man, hit me up. When I know MT, Kamban, and Lamalan. MT, MT is shooting his shot at Pearl. Where the magic, you're throwing. But I'm a dog. Don't you think we look who mean and Hamba no no boy, the going out, the cruising? You better hope your girl doesn't see this episode. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 nigga. Don't, don't, don't be crying about them, man. I'm just shout out to my celebrity crush. What the fuck you doing? <laughs> so, yeah, man. Um, she's beautiful. What do you think of her music? Oh, yeah. Her music is nice, dog. I don't think Boyd is beautiful. I don't you, think she's ugly. You think she's okay? Yeah. I think she's dateable and she's beautiful. I think... If Boiti wasn't as famous as she is, people would see she's not that attractive. It's like so, Ubo Nang. Okay, Ubo Nang I can agree, but with Boiti, she still has this cute face, bro. Pearl, Pearl Tusi is one of those few people who I think is beautiful regardless of Eli Light. Okay, besides the Limelight, I'm going to the picture. Okay, with, with the picture I posted the way she was out, uh, I had two thoughts about it. Yeah. She's fucking on fire, nice. Then Mama sure Nadia with it. this. I, I saw it also. Mama Nadia with this social media stunt with Tamara, Unomtano, what? But in the end of the day, she's a lady. She she needs to look good, and we like her when she looks good. With Unomtano, oh Mama, that comes after. I don't really follow social media, so I'm not sure if I've seen it. I mean, no, so that I've seen a lot of pro 2 
Uh, and I didn't see her because I want to see her, but because MT's been going on about her. Yeah, God, hey, dog. I hope, I hope he, he gets her. Because it's like, it's well, MT, like the whole country. I don't think that's a basic thing. I'm basically taking um, her. Divorced. I'm not sure if the divorce is final, but I know you yeah, know no no. no it's like us again. No mga ke. They they part ways, and it was it was an ugly uh, separation. Yeah, yeah. Ah, that's sad. That's sad, dog. Because uh, he was actually he's always been proud to have. If you mean that, you know, God, but I saw yeah. the cracks in that relationship a long time ago. Like there was a time where they were arguing. Um, MT was shooting an Instagram. This is what I don't like about social media, man. Mm. But in a way, maybe he was trying to protect himself because in that, um, it was like he's saying, "Guti, he wants to show the public." The situation here, the MT, you know, so. One thing I must put on the side, Guti, the wife. The only the wife were ganging up on Ndwana the way it sounded, you know. Oh. So, in the way he shot it and put it on live, or if it was a reel, I don't know if it was live, but he, there's a video of it on social media where by a cabana. I don't think I'll be ever putting stunts like that, like with two chairs. Yeah, but, but just you never know. Out. That's man. it. Though. You okay. never know. You it's never easy, know. It's easy to say that shit, but when you think about it, the way Mina Nibega ngako, yeah. okay. Uh, a lot of niggas are accused of a lot of things these days and mm, it always so favors yeah, 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 shout out to yeah. so, so. them of things are looking good for him or for people who knew their relationship back then before the fame yeah. that's what it's gonna look like basically yeah, so, yeah. hey man if he's just just trying to protect himself then uh, lady man, yeah. shout out to him. It's shout crazy. Him. We were supposed to be talking about Boiti, and I'm not sure I got your opinion on this. Ah, Boiti music, music. I, I was impressing if you got that on the track he did. Who needs to who's that? That's the track I was I was impressed. The project like a couple of few tracks. Not that I know one, but who didn't put a verse? Actually, change that. I was just taking a shout out. I think I actually liked. I liked the idea of Boiti rapping when it first started out, but it's time I, goes, I really. fell out of love with her rap ability quick and mainly because there was it was an ivy sun introduction um i think the song was produced by nasty i don't know if i don't know what was going on was it a cosign from nasty because nasty was big at that time yeah yeah, when yeah. he put boiti on that song and then i heard rumor zuguti um he wrote for her or someone but like as you said in the interview you yeah. were asking it's like i say I, I can't say i wrote it i mm. can't say i didn't write it so nigga, that answer says you everything i know so, um okay uh hit me hit me with your artist i'm fit to mt dog yeah. you know bro i'm not talking about the roll up mt here yeah, yeah, yeah. just to make it clear for the audience you know yeah, yeah, yeah. just to make it clear for the audience yeah, yeah. i'm talking about the not roll up e mt it's like mt literal mt venucular mc rap is he soweto or mambisa ah chambisa clean chambisa nigga yeah yeah our dog Obvious, yes, never disappointed, bro. Yeah. We had a lot of laughs. <laughs> old, old MT <laughs> dog. So old MT, ne? I remember it before. Ah, 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 yeah, all that. Oh, after that beef, I'm going to have a song. What's it beef? Yeah, the Marama artist in a loop. Yeah, that's crazy, man. Marama loop, but like this one. But um, I think the beef served its purpose. Um, at least for us, because yeah. you know these things are usually cloud things. Like last week we were talking about Corsa, big and, Corsa, and, and, and Fad. So, yeah, man, uh, I feel like if maybe that's what led to him working with Ko. Yeah, uh, it worked for, for him. Too, too much because I hate their feet. So I've it, always wanted. I know they always like fuck the industry, but I, I'm always rooting for these um, underground cats to break into the industry. You know, Utana is. is Some of these niggas have been doing this shit a long time. Even MT, Okumura sell us to MT production, but what? But now he's grown up. I was looking at his things, and but Utana, Ono Utakwa, I don't keep up with me quite this too. Yeah. And then um, did, you, did you hear that one? Nah, I don't. I don't really like <laughs> follow his shit like that. Aight, 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 aight. Aight. Another person I was tripping about earlier when the podcast, like in in its early days, yeah, we spoke about Siashes. Oh and yeah. Has he become more commercial now? What's going on with him? He's What's, still. Say I should talk, you know, I'm sure he's doing some underground work and still doing his shit, but as long as niggas are getting their money, man, that's what I just hope they, now. they eating, you know, because I eating as well as eat, they'll be eating, but to that to go as a person, you you always grateful for what you have. So that he's not eating maybe through his music. So that eat he's eating maybe 
I'm sure it's always a, it's, it's a rapper's yeah, dream. Yeah, true, bro. You understand? Yeah. So, yeah, but with MT, dog, uh, dope lyricist, punchline animal, man. Storytelling. Uh, last time, I was like, I killed it. That's probably, probably one of my favorite songs. Yeah. And yeah. I had quite a few MT tracks. Sure. So, yeah. I was like, I'm going to kill it. And I thought he can get I out connect. of his element, though. I you understand? Connect, yeah. So, yeah, I, I believe some of my track, uh, na my first track, uh, MT. Oh, man, sing to man. Waka Miki M on the radio. But I shout out to MT, he produced this, what, mm, what. So, mm. Ntona, like, it's always been... Mm. Season, season scoop days. You remember? Shout out to, to um, that platform. I wish we still had it. I don't know if we have something similar now. Because as much as I tell you I don't watch TV... Yeah. I don't pay attention to much radio these days. What's I don't popping? get time, yeah. I don't get time. What radio I mean so far, I don't see much. But I yeah, yeah. I, I see YFM is still doing that. Yeah, uh, yeah, they're still uh, putting uh, on guests. Oh also Rashid K is doing the same shit. Hmm. You'll be calling out uh, freestylers and yeah, to pull up and do their shandies. Uh, but yeah, Rashid K is keeps as long as there's still platforms that are uplifting young talk. Uh, like spirit. So, Shout out. This is yeah, this is a platform yeah. niggas pull up. So um major league. Yeah, what major league DJs? I'm gonna let you go first. Oh, major league. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, yeah with major league, my thoughts are with major league creative DJs. Yeah. But apparently, I've been hearing some things with some of the things they just throw. Oh God, it's major league yeah. on the tag. They don't, they're not doing shit. <laughs> just like what did you say? What did you say? Sometimes yeah, yeah. they they be like they just throw shit. They they have nothing to do with the song at times. But like, and that's how, how do you go about that? Maybe they pay the artist. They do, but at the end of the day, it's not so kind of major league, but to appreciate it the whole. But anyway, I mean, it doesn't matter. Someone is eating. Yeah, 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 yeah everyone. And at the end of the day, but I heard what is about about talk they actually did schooling in engineering, so they know their shit yeah. and playing. the if they buy. I'm a piece, they don't produce. Yeah. Their, their, their choice is dope. I understand that. Yeah, yeah their beat choice is crazy. And the type of people they, they want on their joints is crazy. When you're in the track, they had Ricky, Abu Kiel, uh, I think also Petro Ranking is there, if I'm correct. It's not even a, a piano, a hip hop sure track. It's a, it's, a nice it's a nice one. It's a nice okay. one. So, with them, yeah. Also, we remember what they did. Speak of share shares, remember what they did in yeah, business. Yeah, well, yeah, they, they, they. Shout out to Major League. So Major League, ah, dope, dope thing. But I think for me, that song, yeah. Business, is is probably where I started to like pay attention to them you know, oh, yeah, properly. Yeah, yeah. And then currently, man, I, I, I don't know how I feel about them. Currently, but 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 how into a piano, man. I feel like I'm still here. I'm in the chicken. I'm high. I'm an eagle. Eagle. What do I do? What do I do? Come on, pay. It was a success, but he he ran out of money. So longer like those days, it's like that. You know, man, what's up, man? I see it's all good. It's major. You be excited. Yeah, it doesn't hit like it used to. Yeah. Uh, also, for Cardi's try to wood. Yeah. Nah, but Joe was part now. But on your side, on your thoughts, it's I uh, just artist. I just feel like it's a loss for us in terms of SA hip hop. It's it's nice Aish. uh for for the country. Yeah. Uh, that they they moving from one genre to, to another. another that we own, which is um, piano. But at the same time, I just feel like they really had a massive impact in SA hip hop. Yeah. Young Tone. Um, even though producers are always or DJs are always more background type of people, but I mean, I I would put them on the same caliber as Abu Switch Abu. So these are people oh, who don't get yeah, enough recognition. Yeah, yeah, they yeah, play yeah. a huge yeah, role. Yeah, yeah, yeah. These, these type of people play a huge role. So, yeah, man. Um, as long as they're getting their money, but other means. I don't know to go far or to disturb you. Yeah. Switch better played role for even for kids like youngster investing in the switch up. Ne, why is switch up? Money, young or my abole. Um, I guess they'll never know. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Um. It's never clear. Yeah, it's clear. It's clear. I'm not sure about the name of the song, but yeah. Um, it's just the way it goes. Uh, Switch been goes, putting yeah. niggas. Yeah, way it goes. Yeah. Switch been putting niggas on for a long time, man. So same with uh, Major League. I just feel like they popped off in Boys and Bugs days, mm. you know. So that era was powerful for everyone. I, I think, think that was an era of the culture which now we're raising hip hop. They yeah. say hip hop to the bar. Ah, they, yo, bro. Mark Figaburi, Kinje. Shit got messy, man. Um... Okay, 
I covered Major League. Next artist is Benny P. Benny P. I do not know who this is. Bro. Benny P. Oh, I was always involved with Google, Ukona, Boy, MT, Mickey. And, but lately, as I was checking his socials, dog has been singing now. Mm. He's singing a lot. And he's quite good. Been checking his things out. Was he a rapper initially? Uh, you would hear bass from Mutuan. But now, he's on some vocal things. And he's a nice voice, nice tune. He knows what he's doing. He knows his shit. Knows what his kind his of vibe would you give him? His vibe. The more the outlay, a guban, uban utum, uban roman logo, osano pixul, loe kitale. Shit, man, who's that? That guy, Okula, Rosala Kure, I ain't a way to buy us to buy, lay and you're called any lay. And maybe you cover on Wibo and yeah, that nigga, he has those vibes. We can make those type of music, that soul music. It's the type of music we tell my figure, maybe am I vibing, maybe like still chilly vibes here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You will find him performing, you wouldn't have a problem. You actually enjoy nigga's not a terrible singer and he doesn't need too much tuning or what. Nice, just has a nice voice. So, I, I, can't, I can't touch much. On him, I literally have no idea who he is. No, I saw he's, my homework. He's a 16 day nigga. Also. Oh, away, away. yeah, yeah, we represent a lot, Musla. Ah, too much, though. Uh, we, 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 we do yeah. a lot, bro. Um, okay, um, Boiti and uh, Major League, uh, okay, almost no similarity, almost mm. no connection because I don't think Boiti's ever tried a hand at DJ. He did. She did. No, I don't think she has. That's what I'm oh, saying. Oh, um, okay, okay, okay. I don't think Major League has ever tried to rap. So there's a huge difference. There. Uh, the only thing that connects them is Casper. Oh, yeah. <laughs> shout out. Middle shout out. of the two. <laughs> so, um, MT and Benny P. I don't know Benny P. So I can't make the similarity oh, or contrast. Okay, with them both from 1630. Yeah. They love the same sound. This kind of sound. Um... Yeah, I'm gonna uh, open to AB Chris. Eh? AB Chris, you talk. Hey, uh, no, it's been last time I checked my tricks. Wow, okay, but Utana is still there on the net doing his yeah. thing. But AB Chris, man, like, he also sings. He sings in his voice. Would you put him on Benny's? He type, type of thing. Yeah, yeah, but, but it's not the same sound, sound but that is type, type of thing. I want to watch him voice around the key. Who sings better? Yeah? Who sings better? Because AB Crazy was all nice. Because I heard you, know, you say like, Benny P can sing. Yeah, he can. So I'll, I'll put it on Benny P. Because I'm going to put it on orchestric singing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Benny P is really singing. But I've never heard him like that. Actually, I know it's hip hop podcast, but we actually, I've been noticing a lot about Ulo 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 Mm. Women are going nuts. Our, our first bit, He's crazy, dog. Yeah. Man is, he's not the same smith or Donna can sing. Just it's it's not it's not my type of vibe. Yeah, but yeah, yeah, yeah. He's he's gifted. Oh, well, shout yeah. out to him. Um. Okay. So we've covered similarity, contrast. Um. You prefer Benny P over MT? Or, no. Oh, over M Crazy. Yeah. Yeah. So, okay. Random thought. Yeah. Talk to me. Um. Okay, let's let, let's try with this one with you. Let yeah. me try the random, random thought today. Okay. So right now you he, you hearing we should you, stop those more often. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right now you hearing a, a one whiskey, ne? Yeah. So with you 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 in a room drinking mm-hmm. whiskey, smoking weed. Understand? It's a good day. Mm-hmm. So on on that room, which celebrity would you want in your presence? That circle. But man, you share a uh, a event, ten guests only. Tickets are 100k, expensive night, beautiful mm. ladies. Uh, yeah, it's cigars and whiskey night. Um, who, from, who are you calling? You from, the, call? from the perspective of a businessman, yeah. given the price range you named and whatever, yeah, I would pick crowd pullers. Yeah, it doesn't matter if I like you or not, but it's, it's not even about skill at this point. If we're sure. talking business, yeah, and those type of numbers, Casper's definitely on there, right? Young Tor. Is it, is it only alive? Can it, can it be? Anyone you want. Even Tupac called to them Tupac. Uh, you gotta, I, gotta, I gotta keep King it local. Okay, I gotta right, keep right. it local. Uh, I'm gonna name five. Okay. You can name five. All right. Um, Cass, a.k.a. K.O. Um, nasty. Nasty's big. Right. Um, mm, mm, mm. The last one is always tricky. Ricky. Okay. Ricky is a 
crazy performance. Right? Shout out, shout out. Since we can use Dead or Alive also, uh, firstly, I'll call Ricky. Yeah. Our one friend, Casino there. Ah, ah shout out. Yango yeah, Akrafa. Uh, and our one Pidoro there, just to have those conversations. Yeah. Melang TPA, his paint game, how he thinks and operate, put Zakwe and Storji there. Because I, I know yeah. also besides the fact anything else, man, Storji lives, man, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. you, you, you heavy, need heavy to understand. Uh, Mipa, great show. Uh, I think Boiti, that was addressed to you. Sure. <laughs> <laughs>